It's time to take out the trash, folks. And this is a bipartisan commentary. This is Dr. David D. Shine, and welcome to this special episode of Saving America. <laughs> And uh, in the news, we've got calls by their own parties for two senators to step out. Dianne Feinstein, age 89, from California, Democrat from California, and GOP's Mitch McConnell, senator from Kentucky, also GOP, um, are both being asked to retire right now. Both of them have been a danger to this democracy for a long time. And hey, their expiration dates are well past. Feinstein has been in office since 1993. McConnell has been in office since 1985. And in my book, Bad Deal for America, both of them are featured and not in a good way because they've said so many stupid things that they deserve to be featured in that book. Uh, McConnell fell at a hotel about five weeks ago, sustained a concussion. Uh, supposedly, he's ready to come back to work. I'm not excited about that. Feinstein's been out since early March. Uh, uh, that's caused a lot of excitement because she's on the Judiciary Committee, and they can't push through their whack liberal judge uh, agenda without her uh, vote. And so it, it's interesting because she's saying she's out because she has a case of shingles, Shingles, while a painful uh, disease, is not, for most people, debil debilitating. Most people take medication and go to work. So I find it interesting that she's claiming that she can't work because she's got an attack of shingles. And again, I'm not happy for her that she's had an attack of shingles, but it makes me wonder if she's had the shingles vaccine, which has been readily available for a number of years. Uh, Mumbles McConnell's only positive action in at least a decade has been to block Merrick Garland, who is presently a failure as attorney general and would have been a disaster on the U.S. Supreme Court. So he's blocked that. Other than that, the GOP has done very, very badly under his leadership. So I'm certainly ready to see him go. And I think many others are. Feinstein has continued to move to the left. This is despite the fact that at one time, I think she actually had a brain, actually could process the fact that commies are bad for everyone. They're bad for humanity. They're bad for every country, not just the United States. And I don't know why she has participated in this far left movement uh, of the Democrat Party. Time for both of them to go home and suck up those big federal tax pension dollars that uh, we've all paid into. One of the things I find interesting is, as you know, they've said Social Security is going to run out of money in 3033 and that we should all take a cut. And, you know, it's interesting because I never hear anybody say that if we have to take a cut in Social Security, the clowns from Washington who are sucking up these big uh, federally subsidized pensions should be cut also. Just a thought, folks, just a thought. This is Dr. David D. Shine for Saving America, and maybe we'll make some progress here in the United States and get rid of losers Feinstein and McConnell at about the same time.